Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Robbie, and this is my craft corner. And today, we're gonna be trying a bunch of fun life hacks. Doesn't that sound great? I just need to finish getting dressed first. Okay, go for it. Okay, now for the sweatpants. Okay! Okay guys, one more thing before we start this video. As you guys may or may not know, a YouTuber named Mr. Beast is trying to plant 20 million trees. And if you guys know me at all, trees are pretty high up there on one of my favorite things. It's up there with like pizza and adventure time and the, you know, trees. We need oxygen, guys. And right now, he's at about 12 million trees. Can you see that? Stupid glare. So for every 10,000 likes, I'm gonna be donating 1,000 trees. Let's cap with 15,000 trees because I'm not, I'm not that rich, guys. Also, if you guys wanna donate yourself, uh, you can click the link down in the description down below and, you know, save the trees, save the planet, save the world. Anyway, guys, let's try out some life hacks. So here are the sandals from my uh, 30 genius glue gun hacks video, part one. <laughs> great video, roll that flashback. Yes, this looks great. I mean, the hot glue's still holding up, so that's good. Wow, okay, so they do kind of work. Anyway, we're bringing these back for a little bit. But first, we have to take these bad boys off. Oh man, there we go. Oh, oh, oh. something just hit me in the eye. Ow, okay. Yeah, don't need these anymore. Awesome, sick. Okay, now we have our soul. Here are those pants that I made in that one video. I forgot uh, what video it was. Not as iconic as a glue gun video, sorry. Anyway, just flip those over, put these into here. Here we go. Yeah, just like that. One like that. Get in there. Aha, cool. Okay, then we break out our scissors. I would just kind of cut around them. Easy, easy. Am I right? I'm gonna leave more space around the edges of it because it looked like they didn't really have enough when they were gluing it. So I'm gonna be a little bit more cautious with mine. Kinda like how there's like the rude tag right there. That's fun. Okay, yeah, don't need this anymore. Not looking bad. Then we just pull these out. Boopity boop. Boopity boop. Yeah, I'm kind of glad that I cut it a little bit bigger because, yeah, it's just definitely a good idea. Anyway, I forgot to heat up the glue gun. Dang it. Okay, I'm going to do that now. Just got to wait for that to heat up. Uh, okay, I think the glue gun's all heated up. So I just need to put the hot glue on. There we go. Don't burn yourself. I burned myself so many times on this glue gun. So much hot glue. It hurts. Be real careful. Okay, cool. Next side. Maybe I should wait for this to cool down first. I think that might be a good plan. So I'm gonna wait for that side to cool down. While I'm doing that, I'm gonna do this one. There we go. Easy peasy. Now for this side. We can do a fabric stretch. Okay, it might not be pretty, but hopefully it'll work. I feel like I need to put something on this to hold it down. What do I have? I have this thing of spring water. Maybe that'll work? I don't know. Okay, next one. There we go. That's not long enough, Captain. Come on. Doesn't want to do it. Okay, I got it. Aha. Okay. Yeah, it looks good. I'm just going to wait for these to cool down, and then uh, we'll try these puppies out. Okay, these bad boys are all dry. Not bad. I don't know if I'd really wear these out in public, but uh, <laughs> let's go try them on. Yeah. I should just slip on the red. Wait, I just noticed something. I grabbed two left sandals. Oh no. I glued it on the wrong side. Oh, I feel so dumb. Okay, doesn't matter. Hopefully these don't work so I don't feel too bad about it. Just gotta slip my foot in there so it's becoming harder than I thought. It's a little tighter. There we go. <laughs> Got it. Not bad. Now for the other foot. Yeah. Oh yeah. Looks a little ridiculous. Not gonna lie. I wouldn't go hiking in these, that's for sure. Let's put these on some light. Yeah. How do you guys feel about my new kicks? Well, I feel like if I would have cut them a little different and maybe like, you know, the bottoms, you know, all together. I feel like this would have turned out pretty cool. Maybe I just need to get bigger pants. I think that's the issue. I think I just need bigger size pants. Or maybe just not girl pants, because these are girl pants and girl pants just have really small pockets. I think that's probably the biggest issue. <laughs> also, I did two left feet. I feel so dumb. Anyway, I'm gonna say that this one uh, kind of works. I'm gonna give this hack like a solid four out of ten. Not the best, not the worst, it's okay. Anyway, uh... <laughs> That's ought to do. Okay, so uh, here's our wine glass. Here's our cup. Here's our ball. Now I have to try and transfer this ball into this glass, just like they did. Here we go. Oh, almost. Come on! Uh, nope. Come on! You can do this. Ready? And. No. Nope. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and try a bigger glass. Here we go. And. Oh! Okay, 
so here's our bottle. Here's our dollar. It's uh, actually ripped, so I'm sorry. It's the only dollar I had on me, okay? Put our coins on there. I feel like it's supposed to kind of like flap out a little bit more. I'm gonna fix those really quick. Here we go. <sighs> Ready, Robbie? You can do this. One, two, and. So close, I didn't grab it. One, two, and. <gasps> I did it! What? I freaking did it! The coins didn't move! Well, guys, I guess we're gonna say this works! So here's my glass bottle. Here's our straw. So we just need to put this in like that. And it's not working. It doesn't want to lift. What am I doing wrong? Oh, I see. I see the error of my ways now. I had to bend this and then put that in. It's still not working. I think it's because this has too much of like a slant. It's not working. Well guys, I guess we're gonna have to say that this one doesn't work. Sorry. Take that, science. Actually, I'm gonna try it with this Coca-Cola bottle. It has more of the shape that they're going for, so maybe this one works. Oh, and... And... Maybe it'll work if I take the liquid out. Okay, we took the liquid out. Let's try this again. And... It works! Wow! It's like magic! I guess we're gonna have to say that this one does work. I'm sorry, science. I didn't mean to diss you like that. Okay, so this one seems pretty simple. Here's a one wadden glass. Here's another one glass. They use two regular cups in theirs, but uh, I don't have two matching cups, so this will have to do. So here we go. I'm gonna have to balance. It's just like that. Ah! How did they do this? I don't know how they did it. Maybe I shouldn't use a glass. I did it! Woo! I am genius, see? Now we're just gonna go ahead and light this puppy on fire. Come on. Ah, oh, it didn't work. Let me try it again. Am I supposed to let this burn out? I feel like I'm not supposed to. Okay, I'm gonna try it with different matches. Okay, so apparently I lied, and I do in fact have two matching cups. See? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, break out the bigger matches. Get out of here. Yeah, that's definitely a bigger match. There we go. Okay, here we go. You ready? One, two, and... Dang it. I messed up. One more time. No! One, two, and... Ah! What am I doing wrong? No! <gasps> Maybe if I keep it on top of it, that'll help? I don't know. Okay, you ready? One, two, and... Okay, yeah. Guys, I'm gonna have to say that this one doesn't work. Okay, so here's our paper, here's our two cups, put that on there. I don't have a third cup, but you know what? I have this can of body spray. That didn't work. Now let's try their method of folding it. Fold, fold, fold. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. You ready? One, two, and... Wow, I don't think I'm doing this right. Maybe I have to fold it even more. Where did that go wrong? Okay, we'll try this again. Ready? I believe in it this time. And... Well guys, I guess we can say that this one works! Okay, so here's our Coke can, here's our glass. Put that in there just like... Put that in there just like... Oh my gosh. Put that in here just like... Just like that. I'm the real MVP here. Okay, then we're gonna get this cup that still has my tea bag in it. Okay, let's hope this works. You ready? One, two, and... What? I was not expecting that to actually work. That's so cool. So close. No. Okay, I'm gonna see if Tori can do this one. Tori Nebranski. Tori says she doesn't want to do it right now. Well, guys, I guess we can say that this one works. Uh, the only thing is, it just takes a lot more skill to get it into another cup. But I mean, the blow me up thing works. Look. That's so cool! Science! I wish I could explain how that works, but, you know, it's fine. Okay, guys, so here is our bottle. Go ahead and fill this up with water. Woo, I did it. I don't need this anymore. Let me get our straw. Just gonna go ahead and ASMR for you guys. Oh, nice. Anyway, now I need a cup. Hey guys, let's try this. You ready? 
Oh, I got it all over my phone. Well, guys, I guess we can say that this one works. What a fun little trick. Okay, guys, so here's our balloon. Let's just go ahead and blow this up really quick. Okay, yeah, it looks good. Here's our glass. Now we're just gonna go ahead and light a match. Real easy peasy. And put that in there. Oh, it's sucking it in. Wow, it actually worked a little bit. You actually, I can lift it. That's hilarious. One more time for good measure. I feel like this is gonna pop the balloon. Oh, God, it did. That was scary. Well guys, either way, I guess we can say that this one works. This is still on fire. <laughs> oh, okay. So it looks like we're gonna need one coin and then another coin, uh, which appears to be a penny on top of that. Looks good. And then we get a really small match and then put that on top of that. I don't know how they balanced it. This is so hard. Okay guys, so I just had a freaking heart attack. So I went to go switch lenses so that I could zoom in a little bit more like that. And I freaking dropped my wide angle lens. And I went to go pick it up and I heard like a rattle and my heart dropped. Anyway, luckily it's just the filter. So we're all good. I thought I broke my $2,000 lens. That would have sucked. Anyway, let's keep doing this. Okay, so here we go. So we got our penny on here. Now we just have to, oh, dang it. Now we just have to balance it again. Ah! Okay, good enough. And we balance the little match on there. Ah! This is way harder than it looks. Ah! I did it! Yes! Oh my freaking gosh. I don't know why that was so difficult, but it was. And we just go and put a cup over it just like that. Good, good. So they just had a basic pen and then uh, like a cloth. I'm gonna go ahead and use my beanie. There we go. So I guess I just kind of rub it on there like that. And then theoretically it should move. It's not moving. Okay, so I have to do it on this side. So maybe it'll work better on this hat because it's more fluffy. It's not working, guys. I honestly don't know what to tell you. It's not working. I'm thinking maybe it's a static electricity thing, so I'm gonna go ahead and get a balloon. Kinda rub it on my head. Get that static electricity. Maybe that'll do something. <gasps> oh, it works! Oh my gosh. Hey guys, are you ready? It's gonna move. Okay, you ready? <gasps> See, it moves. It's moving! What? And it's stuck. I got it stuck. Well, that's cool. I guess we could say that this one kind of works. It's kind of hard to say that it works with the pen, um, but it definitely worked with the balloons. I guess I'm gonna have to say that this one uh, kind of works. Okay, so for this one, gonna need some water. Also, two wine glasses. And I just gotta fill one of them up with water. That looks good. And I just get a match. And then I have to try and make these two touch. Okay, ready? I feel like this would be better from a different view. Okay, this looks much better. Here we go. So I have to try and make these two matches touch. You ready? I think I have to make like a like, really high pitched sound, which I'm pretty good at doing. You ready? Come on, you can do it. Does this have to be filled with water or anything? It doesn't look like this one's filled with water, but I'm gonna try it with just a little bit. Okay, let's do it. It fell off. Okay, we'll try this again. Nothing's happening. Like, wh what am I doing wrong? This is so strange. Is this not supposed to be wet or something? I mean, this isn't wet at all. I just cleaned it off. Let's see. We'll try it one more time. Nothing's happening. I just keep bumping it. Dude, why isn't this working? I think they have theirs more on the edge. So I'm gonna try that. Here we go. They did two fingers, so I'm gonna try two fingers. Moment of suspense, please. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. My head is starting to hurt. I'm really not sure what I'm doing wrong here. Well guys, I'm just gonna go ahead and say that this one doesn't work. Dang, I literally tried for five minutes and my head hurts so bad. <laughs> Okay, so I can already tell that this one's gonna be a little weird. Okay, here we go. So we got our two matches. Here's our coin. Now we have to somehow make these not fall down. Wait, I think they put a hole in the matchbox like that. Well, why would they do it on top of a matchbox? That just seems so silly. So I, I'm pretty sure that they put a, like a hole in the matchbox just like that. I feel like this is a little dangerous. So they did that and they got the other match. I put it right here. 
It doesn't say that they put a hole in the matchbox, though. That's what's confusing me. Like, how they make the match stay up. Ah! This is so aggravating. I can't get it to stay up. No! I did it! Woo! Okay, now we just gotta light it on the fire. Ah! It kind of worked. I removed it without it falling. I just had it burning too long. I'm gonna give it one more try. Okay, we did it! Okay, ready and... Ready? One, two, and... I did it! I remember the coin! Woo! It's even hovering a little bit. I don't know if you guys can see that. Come on, focus, focus. Yeah, it's even hovering a little bit. You see? Well, guys, I guess we can say that's what works. Dude, that's so cool. Match science. Okay, guys, now it's our favorite part of the video where we agree the thumbnail. Woo! Okay, so for this one, I'm gonna need uh, what looks to be an iPhone. So I actually bought the newest iPhone 11. Uh, just so you guys know it's real and not bad. It's pretty good. There's the three cameras. It's like, I don't know. I'm just not an iPhone guy. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it in half. I'm not sure what method I should use for this. Um, hmm. I'm thinking maybe this saw? Yeah. I think this should do. Or maybe should I use this one? I think this one might be a little overkill, but it has a finer edge, so I think it might work a little better. So I'm actually gonna use this one. Okay, so here's my clamp. Here's our iPhone. I'm gonna pull this down a little bit. Yeah, there we go. I'm thinking maybe the other side, actually. That's a little better. Okay. I hope this doesn't break the screen. Well, what does it matter? If it cracks the screen, it cracks the screen. What are we cutting the frickin' iPhone in half anyway? What's it matter? Am I right? Anyway, come on. Oh. This is proving to be a little harder than I thought. Okay, here we go. Let's do this, guys. Ready? One, two. Also, I want to tell you guys, don't try this at home. There's a chance this might explode. I have a fire extinguisher on the wall in case it does, so. Okay, well, it looks like we're not using a clamp. <laughs> My mouse is just, like, bouncing up and down. Okay, we made a little bit of progress. Not bad. I'm gonna take a bathroom break really quick. Please don't explode while I'm gone. Okay, we're back. Let's try this again. I got another clamp. Yeah. That ought to hold it. There we go. That's not going anywhere. Ready? One, two, and... Oh, it really doesn't want to cut in half. My gosh. That's crazy. Well, let's keep going. Woo! We are through. Holy crud. Wow. Weird. That's what the inside of an iPhone looks like. Anyway, I'm really glad that didn't explode. Yeah, that's pretty good. Anyway, guys, let's recreate the thumbnail. Okay, guys, and uh, here we go. Hey guys, remember how I said at the beginning of the video I would donate $1,000 for every 10,000 likes you guys give me? Well, I got impatient. I didn't want to wait for this video to be posted, and okay, I'm gonna do it. And there I am. Woo! Woo! It's done! It's been a really great year for me, and I just really wanted to get back, and I wanted to thank you guys all for getting me to the point where I can donate 15,000 trees. You guys are all amazing. I love you guys all so much. But please still like the video. <laughs> if you guys like this video, you guys want to watch me do even more fun life hacks and crafts, I have a whole playlist taking me doing them right here. If you guys are new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys want to help donate trees, you can click right here in the description down below. Okay, guys, I love you so much. I'll see you guys again real soon. Peace, love, and Wi-Fi. Awkward editing. Okay, bye. Ah!